Okay, let's finish this stuff. We're still fighting over the enemy prime here and still riding high. We're, we've got them beat down to 46 to 100 and we're just shooting down everything that comes at us. That's Ali Sergio. He's, uh, I think he's the weak link in the chain there. He's a nice guy. He keeps playing. That's a good thing. Not one of the better players, but he's, he's faithful. He's always there, so we love him. I love anybody that plays this game. I don't care, you know. If they're no good, that's all right. It's a, it's a, it's good, you know. Well, okay. They're trying, you know. They, when they keep playing long enough, they'll get it. I play, I played this stuff for years, you know. But I can't believe I just did that. I think I might have got it though. Yeah. Okay, got it. That was really dumb. For a second there, I thought I was actually going to kill that tank with that suicide, but. That was a pretty lame hope, actually. We are still doing really well. We are holding down the enemy prime, and they're just having no luck at all. We've got the we've got the we've got the mine node. Our orb isn't in motion, but we've got everything else. I uh, mentioned on the previous video, yeah, Bar is on the other team. And at some point you're going to start to, at some point he's going to start, it's, that's going to start having an effect. Because what Barr is going to do on this map is start running the orb over and over again. And it's, it may take him a while to get that going, you know. It's a lot of that, because, you know, a lot, because like, things like, you know, running the orb is not something you do all by yourself. I mean, you can do it by yourself, but you're not as effective as you are if you can get somebody to help you out with it. And that's the major thing, you know. Oh, this is a... Well, that's an interesting approach, I guess. Not the best way to get to the enemy prime, but we're getting there. Okay. Uh, let's see, we're going to manage to take out this bender. Yeah. I probably ought to suicide into the node, but, well, it's, there's not a huge hurry. There's no, there's no fire on our node at all. The enemy prime is... Pr the enemy orb is probably on his way, though. I don't see it, but he's probably out there somewhere. Mana with Berserk, yeah, okay. That's sheep are warm in that. They're starting to show some life. The nuke just came up and somebody got it, and which team got that is going to make a bit of a difference. It's probably our team, though, because if it were the blue guy, if it were blue that got that or blue that got the Deemer, we, or their prime would have probably gone down by now. They're still taking all kinds of damage on their core. We're gonna get them way down before they start. Okay, now they got their prime back, which is why, which is why I've been oh, yeah. heading in their direction. I've been anticipating their prime would go down, so that, it makes sense that I would go straight there instead of going over to the mine first. But they don't have a whole lot of defense, so I'm able to just jump right up here. If there's any, if there's no, def oh, there is a guy over there with a shotgun. Right, he's gonna be a problem. I'm gonna drop down here and avoid him and cap that way. I'm not, I don't, I don't go in for fancy stuff, you know, I'm not going to try to jump over his head or anything like that. If I can get the job done by just dropping down, that'll work, you know. Oh, they're going to take it right back. Yeah, they're starting to, they're starting to uh, look like they know what they're doing now. That's a major thing, you know, on the, on, on most of these maps, you know, it's a major thing is you got to keep the ore moving. Even if you gotta run it yourself on foot, that's better than having it sit there motionless. Always, I mean, you get up against a team that knows what they're doing, and the orb is gonna be coming in like every 20 seconds, every 30 seconds, you're gonna look up and there it is, coming right in. And yep, now they're running the orb into our prime. We're about to lose our prime, there he is. Unless I can, and I can't stop him, so there you go. I killed him, but not, but don't, but not until after he caps, so. A lot of people would just whip out their shock rifle and combo them down, but uh, I'm not that fast, and I don't know that it's, well, it probably is better if you know how to use it. Yeah, I'm parked out here, I'm waiting for Manus to come in, but I'm not seeing them, they don't have their stuff that much together, and now the Prime is down, so I'm going to rush forward to it. At this point, I could turn around and grab the orb and do that, but it, since I've got this vehicle, I'd rather rush forward and try to defend with it. We'll see what we got to deal with when we get there. I don't know why I'm going around this way. I'm thinking there's a tank up here. Okay, I want to take this guy down, that's why. 
Yeah, and there's the blue orb. I want to take that down, definitely. Okay, he's down. Another kill there. But our prime is down. Well, we capped it back right away. And now, you know, the question is, do I rush forward and attack the enemy prime or stay here and defend? It looks like blue's about to have a... Okay, well, take it. Let the scorpions cancel each other out. Blue's about to get a levy, which is not good. It'd be a real good thing to take down that, that pr enemy prime very quickly. I don't know how likely we are to do that, but we better do it quick. Just get their turret out so he's less defense, but I really ought to be shooting at the... I really need to be shooting at the prime is what I need to be doing, but they got people out there covering it, which isn't going to help. And I'm the only one here shooting at it, which isn't going to help, so there's not much chance of me getting this. Yep. Attack the mine node. Yeah, we're not doing good. There's no there's no fire on the enemy prime and we got an incoming Attack incoming blue levy, so at this point it's gonna start turning around. This is the point where I said before that you know if this had gone on a little further, probably would have lost this. This is actually very desperate for red. I mean, as, as far as head as we are, if, if we don't start getting, if we don't start acting like we know what we're doing, we're gonna lose this very quickly. Well, we got the levy down, so that's a good thing. But there's that red, there's the blue orb, and he's probably gonna manage to cap. Very likely. It doesn't look like it at that point. Okay, we got, yeah, okay, we took their orb out, okay. Yeah, I don't know how many times I've, I've seen, you know, I've seen, I've seen cluster fucks like that, you know, come together, and, and it looks like you got their orb down, but then, no. You know, at the end of the, at the end of the day, when the, when they're done, when they're done, when everybody's done jumping on top of each other, the enemy orb will come out on top and cap anyway. You know, you never jump out of that assuming that's not going to happen. It's probably going to happen unless you stop it. You got to, you got to take the, it's not enough just to take the orb down. You got to suicide on it. You got to kill it. Okay, we're getting a, we're getting a, we're going to make an attempt here to cap the enemy prime, which is what we should be doing. And I'm going to escort from behind to try to distract anybody. I'm going to make a little distraction here. And, um, well, we're going to cap anyway. That's what matters. That was well done. We salvage this thing if I can get it out. Oh, you got killed trying to pick it up. That didn't work out. And it looks like the vehicle behind me that I should have been supporting got took out too, so that's not good. Let me take this guy out anyway. Ali Sergio. Blue has their prime back, of course, so I'm just going to go on defense. I mean, I see which way this is going. We, we just got to hold out. We're just trying to hold out to overtime and and tick down that 15 points. That's the big question. Can we hold on long enough to tick down their core 15 points? We got fire on their prime, but there's going to be an orb come in, I'm pretty sure about at this point. The only question is where is he going to come from? That guy down there shooting, he's not the major problem. Oh, we might cap their... No, nah, we're not going to cap. Our orb's down. Five, four. Three, two, one. I'm pretty. I'm. I'm. I'm yeah. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a blue orb coming here. Leviathan construction. Or I'm gonna get shot out of here with a sniper, and then the orb's gonna come in. Leviathan under construction. Oh, we got their prime down. Okay, that's good. And we are in overtime. Getting very close. I'm gonna. I'm gonna run the orb. Okay, well, let's. That's always a good thing to do. Maybe this wasn't as close as I thought it was. I mean, we're looking pretty good right now. Okay, we got some guy here. Yeah, he's spawn camping. Okay. I have to look out for him. He's got me down to 20 points. I was going to go after the mine node, but now there's, but now there's, now our prime's being threatened, so I kind of feel like I better go get that. And there's somebody firing at the mine node anyway. And us being in overtime, we really do need to be controlling nodes. It, it's be, it, it, the important thing is to control some nodes because the number of nodes you controls affects how. Oh, how can we get hit by a mana? That's bar. The number of nodes you control is going to affect. Okay, we're about to win this. Yeah, we did win it this way. All right, maybe not as much drama as I thought. Have a good evening. Look at those scores.